Wilmer Flores, the most, uh, most popular guy in this building every time, <laughs> every time you come back. You know, what, I, I mean, we, we saw you here in 2019. Obviously, it was emotional for you to return then, but what is it like when you just step back into City Field? Well, it's always, it, it's always fun to come back, you know, and every time, you know, fans see me and, you know, they, you hear things like, we love you, we miss you, we want you back, and, you know, it's, it's always a good feeling. Are you ever surprised by the level of of love that you receive? I mean, it's, you know, yesterday I saw you down the line signing autographs for 10, 15 minutes, got a huge ovation the other night when you stepped to the plate. Does does it surprise you at all at this point? It does, it does a little bit. You know, uh, when, was it on Tuesday, my first at bat, you know, I got my walk-ups on and everything, and um, they were loud, and you know, it got me a little bit. It got me a little bit, um, but I, I really appreciate it. It makes me, it makes me feel real good. You know, Wilmer, when we look back at, at your career here, and you know, obviously you you had these moments that that kind of elevated you in the in the lore of Mets history and, and with this fan base. What do you think it it was that so resonated with this fan base about you and and the way you played, and and obviously the emotions that you showed. Yeah, well, you know, the Met fans are really passionate. You know, they uh, they they love uh, the team. They love uh, the, the. I mean, they, they're involved with everything that's going on. And um, you know, what, what happened in '15 when you know the, there's so many emotional out there. You know, they saw the uh, uh, the human part of of, um, of me and you know of, of players, uh, and re they really appreciate that. You know, I I really like the team that we had, and uh, they just saw that out there. You know, the other night, probably when you were hitting, Ron said something on the broadcast about how that home run that you hit against Washington a couple nights later, that is one of the top home runs, the top regular season moments in Mets history. And when you look back on that night, I mean, do you realize the level to which that has kind of ascended to? Do you, now looking at it from, you know, not necessarily in the moment, do you realize where that sits? Yeah, that... It's it's up there. It's yeah. definitely up there. But um, I really, all I remember was the interview after everything <laughs> because um, I just blacked out when when I hit the ball and you know it was my first walk up. Also, I didn't know the the ball was gone and I just I just saw it going uh, over the fence and I just went crazy. But I blacked out. I don't remember much. <laughs> Do you remember tugging at your jersey at the the Mets jersey? Yes, I do remember that, and it was everything was fast, man. I I, I wish I could I could have slow, slow it down a little bit yeah. to enjoy more, but uh, you know it was just excitement. Do you remember what you were thinking? Why it was important for you to to grab that that jersey and the Mets, you know, written across your chest? Um, you know, I just wanted to show that I'm. I belong here and that, that I was still there. Do you have a favorite moment when you look back at your time with the Mets that wasn't the ones that get talked about all the time, that wasn't the you know, moment on the field that, that endeared you to the fans, that wasn't the, the walk-off home run? Is there something else that stands out about your time? It has to be those uh, three World Series games. Yeah. You know, we obviously we didn't win it, but um, just – Playing in a World Series here in City Field was fun. Uh, I, I think that uh, it's one of our top moments. I'll leave you with this. When you made your return to City Field two years ago, you hit a home run against Jacob deGrom. How disappointed are you that you didn't have a chance to do that again? <laughs> oh, man, I told him yesterday, I'm, I'm, I'm sad you're not pitching because I had another one for you. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, man, I, I'm, I'm always looking forward to see Jacob pitch. It's, it's just fun.